Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So, uh, between episodes, I repaired our mechs. And let's have a look at the mech bay here. We went through a financial statement. I didn't sell the XL engine yet, but uh, Storm Crow Prime. So, the fire control system on this, because I've got the Clan TTS uh, in the torso here, which gives plus two accuracy, I couldn't actually use the uh, fire control system energy in the... In the um, uh, slot up here because I need a clan uh, fire control system in here so unfortunately had to leave it as it is but what I was able to do was take that TTS and upgrade um, the Cougars TTS from our normal one to the bonus one um, and then what we did is in the Nova since we picked up that fire control system Rainmaker um, I dropped it in here this should help this mech out a little bit uh, it does minus 15% heat generation from missile fire, uh, which is great. We can swip, swap this in and out um, as we see fit on the hot planets and stuff uh, and go with the advanced zoom and stuff. But we added the uh, sensor sniper that I had picked up a little while ago in here as well to give them better sensor and sight range um, and a little better chance to spot enemies, which is good. So that's upgraded this mech a little bit. And we should be ready to go. Oh, yeah, also on the... Um, the Storm Crow, what I did is I swapped out the ER medium pulse for just a regular medium pulse. And the reason why I did that is I got, f it's got five um, less heat. Uh, yes, we have a um, uh, lower uh, maximum range, lower optimal range, but it also has plus one. This has got plus one more accuracy and it ignores one more evasion pips. So it's just a better weapon to hit. So because we can close really quickly, and we got the Warfare Suite and stuff. I just figured this would probably be a little bit better. Our heat efficiency, once again, is a little better now, too. Um, we should be able to fire all our lasers pretty much most of the time now on a regular world. So that's uh, just going to help us out a tiny bit. So let's have a look at what kind of contracts we have. So actually, you know what? Let's have a look at the barracks real quick. I think we had a couple mech warriors that just needed a little bit of experience. So let's have a quick look here. Uh, blockade. Um, so we got cold shot on him last time. You could go for heat generation or stability bonus. I think let's go for heat generation on him for this one. Training confirmed, Commander. And El Duce. We're waiting for gunnery, so now we got that, so let's confirm that. Training complete. Um, next time we're going to go for tactics. Uh, Griff himself, we're still waiting for the next level of gunnery. And yeah. Mockingbird, I think. Most likely, um, mm, I think we leave it. We go for gunnery on her as well. Yeah, so we'll go that route. So in the contracts here, there is a contract I'd like to take. And it is, if we go to here, mopping up a three skull against Clan Wolf. Uh, just basically, it's in the Badlands too, which is a little better for us, but... Um, They've got damaged mechs that need to be repaired. Um, they want to track track these survivors down and wipe them out for good. So it's three skulls, so hopefully we can find some good mechs and some good salvage here. And once again, we're going to go for full salvage and accept. And deploy and get this sucker done. Ah, oh, great. What do you think there's another lance? I don't think so. How do we want to play this though? Don't know what they have. Waiting for orders. Let's just move up this way. I don't feel comfortable pushing these guys. Good to go. Once we can identify a little more what they are. Location confirmed. Stay under the ECM bubble. Gotcha. Enemy detected. Huntsman, 50 tons. Standing by. Nova, nice. Knowledge. 
Hellbringer Prime, 65. Wow, really good chances to hit, man. They got weak armor, so let's try and get some leg shots in early. Ah, a couple of leg shots, but I don't think it was on the leg we wanted. I can't tell now. Um, Waiting for orders. Full speed. Want to no push time. this Nova, I think. Get those feet wet. Um. All weapons are go. Get these feet wet. I'm switching targets because I don't want to um, destroy this Hellbringer. I want to go after those legs. We need more uh, ability to do some called shots. We should be able to get very shortly. So let's do damage where we can. Just outside optimal range, but... Well, long range, but whatever. Okay. Can you go after this leg and fire? And get the opposite one? Sure, man. Oh, hits on both legs, I think. How do we do there? Yeah, a little bit on both. Don't think you're the best guy for doing this one. Shoot this guy. And fire. Ooh. Sounded like three leg hits there. Or at least looked like it. Badass. Yeah, badass. Uh, we can't get to the side of that guy. May not be the best way to go. We're gonna hammer this guy in the side again. Okay, arm. He's taking a bunch of leg hits too. Can't tell though. Thanks for coming out. Okay. Those things are so damn loud. Alright, not a good test of how well these uh, heat systems are working, but we pummel this guy. Get a multi target. Pulses will go to B, everything else to A, and fire. Fire. What's that Nova doing? Come on, Bubba. We need to finish you guys up, get some salvage, and get on to the next mission. 
Ooh. Nova v Nova, man. Barely hit, Commander. It's a lot of twelves, dude. It's not barely hit. It's a lot of twelves. Twelve, twelve. Commander? Twelve, twelve. Let's sing a song about twelve. I do remember my Sesame Street. All right, let's get on this guy. Defensive push, leg only, going with the two big ones, and I don't know, it's not gonna be enough. Let's go with three. Let's hope we get it. Okay, there's the left leg and left torso. Too much damage, 204, 104, pilot health. All right, Griff, uh, you're not going to go on that guy. Let's get you um, up here. And on this Hellbringer here. And fire everything. Okay, there's the leg. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Okay, what are they doing? We got a chance to take both these guys. Well, it always looks scarier when you're like behind the mech and everything's coming at you. It's awesome. <laughs> That's why I leave camera angles on. It's so much fun. And they've really fixed Rogue Tech with the ability to be able to uh, now see your opponents again. It's just so much more fun being able to see sh stuff like that. Move into position. Okay, so this guy doesn't have much left in his leg. This guy, I have no idea. So we're going to target him. Oh, he doesn't have much left, left there either. Um, let's go with one. I don't want to blow him up. Affirmative. Don't hit him in the groin. Oh, he bailed out. <gasps> Even better. Shocking. Did I get that leg? Um, yeah, let's go that route. I'm on it. Nice. Maximizing salvage. Let's wreck the huntsman. Um, oh, he shut down. Not good for him. Not good for him. Let's finish him up. There we go. That's a kill. All right, three skulls. Not bad. Mission successful. Be taking more of those in the future. All right, so let's see what we got here. Um, no real damage. And lots of juicy pieces. Hope we get some Nova parts here, but we'll see what happens. So what do we get? Uh, LBX, medium pulse lasers. Cooling plus three. I was actually thinking about just just the other day. We've got a slot for this in the Stormcrow. Uh, we may want it for the future. Don't know. XL Clan engine. We go for cash. Maybe. Maybe Clan double heatsink kit. Laser AMS. We don't have any of these guys. But ammo. We don't really need any ammo. Although ATM HE ammo would be nice as a backup, but I don't think we really need it right now. Um, laser AMS. We want to go for some Argo upgrades, so let's do this and let's do this. Save some space in the um, Stormcrow. Although another ATM-12 would be nice. 
Don't really have the ammo for it though. Let's go this route. That mech we didn't want. Three Huntsman parts and Nova E. We got the ATM-12, ER medium. Yeah. Okay. 18,000. Let's get repaired and back into battle here. Alright. Let's get this stuff up and running. And before we go any further, let's go back to the store real quick. Because I want to go in and... I got nothing here. I want to sell the two Ultras, XL, Clan XL engines we picked up the past two missions. I'm going to keep one. We're going to go to Engineering because now we have a bit of coin. Let's go in here and let's get our power systems level two up and running. All right, I'll get the team on it right away. Because we need that for other things over here. So let's get that working right now. And let's go back to the command center. Oh, we got to get our guys back here. One sec. Man, I'm notorious for doing that. All right, three days. All right, there we go. Let's have a look at what else we can do around two and a half, three skulls here. Show of force, escorting, hide the evidence, which is a destroy base. I'm just very sheepish to do this in the Martian environment because I know the map that we'll be going on. It's pirates, though, so it's not really worth it. This is against Clan Wolf, this one, I think. Um, yeah, Wolfie and Agents. Let's try it. I mean, we can always bail out. One man's art in the Badlands. And accept. <clears throat> Let's deploy and get this done. Alright. Ah, uh, okay. Sure is, and this is also a tricky map because they can pretty much see us from everywhere on this map. They got a lance up here and a lance down here. Uh, one guy, two guys, three guys, four, and then I have no idea what's up there. So we've got to try and wreck these guys fast. Um, but I don't want to move in all the way at first. Let's ECM it up in here. Get into a strike range. I'm there. And then bur burst in next turn. Yep. Good to go. I don't think they moved. Moving out. Hmm, let's reserve. Copy that. Standing by. They're not going to do a goddamn thing, are they? Oh. Patton. I think it's got an AC-10 if I remember my battle tech correctly. Both Robles and Pattons, I think, at AC-10s. Um, out. See if we can apply some early damage on this guy. He's got half armor. Dump everything into him. Good shooting. Good shooting. Uh, firing the normal ATMs. Waiting for orders. Does that put us in range? Wow, we are one square off. Okay. Firing. Still got lots of armor. Alright, Griff, let's see if we can finish him up. And yeah, fire. There it is, folks. Enemy unit destroyed. 
Huh. Now they're moving. Ice ferret, 45 tons. We faced these guys before. Or we faced an ice ferret before. Don't remember what it had on it, but I know we faced one before. Okay, vehicle moving. It's right in here. Saw a blip there for a second. Cougar. Now he's coming from the other side, I think. I think this ice ferret, we're just going to run over him. Roger that. Standing by. Let's just go do this. Okay, what do we got here? Arinya? Commando 2C. Better chance to hit this guy. Let's see if we can grind him down. We are not going to um, push this too far. We do want this guy gone. Okay. Get into here. I think we'll switch over to HE. Yeah, might as well take the extra damage. Okay, he's not having a good day. One second here. I've got to scratch my ear. Yeah, let's get Mockingbird in there. Keep our torso turned a little bit left in case we got guys in front of us here. And let's hammer this guy. Thank goodness for weak armor. Okay, we're going to push the base and grab the uh, guy and then head up the hill. Not worried about the cougar over here. ER mediums. Pegasus. God, we're running so cool. Wolverine 2. Nice. Kit Fox. 17. Medium ER. What was it? Medium ER pulse. What? Two medium ER pulses and a heavy medium. Medium pulse, that's where I'm six normal, ultra f five. Can we tag that guy? Well, I guess we shoot this guy then. We are running excruciatingly cool even on this uh, planet. These are supposed to be AMSs, I guess, on his shoulder. Commander? Could you imagine running three AMSs in this? Rolling. Yeah, I gotta look at the heat on this guy. Ready for orders. Don't know if we're running a um, an exchange or not, but we have a uh, double time. Let's go. Heat sink cooling pod. We might be able to drop in. Help a little bit anyway. Negative damage. Negative damage. Ooh. Watch my feet. 
that the cougar or somebody else? Receiving you. Hmm. Yeah, let's not and say we did. Five point one percent. That dog just won't hunt. Let's use the grinner to grab the guy here. It's got to cool down for a turn anyway. We'll get everybody else on this Pegasus, I think, and try and get rid of it this turn. Well, maybe not. Seventy one. Really? Really? That's pretty damn good chance to hit. Okay, let's get cooled off. Kind of hoping for a little bit more challenging missions on these ones, but kind of glad it's just easing us into it. Bear Cub. Can't remember if we got Bear Cub parts or not. I know we fought a Bear Cub before. Yes, Commander. Heating up real fast over there. Let's see if we can get that vehicle. Yeah, fire. I'm on it. There it is. Guns off the field. Kid Fox has got to go. See where he's headed. Hmm. The 7H version, okay. Even that would be good. 7H version is the one that we have in uh, Night Witches. It's Babiaga's mech. Um, let's just dump stuff on this guy. It's kind of in our way. We'll have to get up there soon at some point. Excellent. Come on, you guys. Bring it. Formex. Wow. You're just going to give us that back, are you? Just gonna do it. Targeted. We'll take it. There you go, guys. If you ever want to know how to commit suicide, that's how you do it. Standing by. Let's get back in the ECM bubble. Shoot that Wolverine. I'd love to see what I'd love to know what these guys are seeing on our side. Anyway, firing all this. Arm, maybe? Torso? Arm? Commander, I'm hit. 
Error not set. Pilot injury. Standing by. It's the error not set. Pilot injury. Coordinates received. All right, firing on this guy. You are in our way. Nice. Got past his armor. Smooth. Got El Duce left. We can hammer that guy up there, I think. Let's see if we go before him. I don't think we do. I think this guy's going first. Yep, here he comes. The asset is under fire. Really? Hadn't noticed, Darius. Damage minimal. Had not noticed. On my way. Jeez, and all this fighting and carnage? I had not noticed that. Ah. Here comes. Guess we knock him down? Well, he's down permanently now. Target eliminated. And then there was two. Let's give this guy the what for. And fire it all. Thank goodness for weakened armor. Yeah, we're okay. Just attack this guy and finish him up. No point in overheating. He, all the way, firing. Let's get right on this guy. Optimal range. And yeah, fire it all. The there it is, folks. Let's get that second... Uh, Asset and get out of here. Nicely done. Now, if they were fully armored, it would have been a little different story. But I think the way we moved through that was the plan was sound. Taking the right side first and then moving from a strength of position in the buildings and the trees to the left. There we go. Just enough. Excellent. What do you need? Hunkering down. Yes. There it is, folks. Let's go home. Okay, contract payment increased by 30%, which is good because it puts us over a little bit. That'll be enough for repairs. I think the grinder took a little bit of damage. Didn't take any component damage, I don't think. Oh, it's nice to check. Nothing. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, a lot of mech parts. Can't finish anything off. Unfortunately, we got three components, eh? Clan small pulses. Ultra 10. Mm. Advanced AMS. That's kind of really nice. Plus one defense for the whole lance. Let's take that. Um, Clan Exchanger. We've got one already, but I want another one. Um, Fire Control System Artemis. We have one already. Clan Pharaoh. We have four. XL Gyros. I, I can't use on Omnimax, unfortunately. Heat Bank would be really nice, though. Ooh, that's a good one, too. Um, yeah, I think that's what we take. Yep, we take those. Okay, two bear cub parts, commander two C part, two ice ferret parts, which is nice. Kit Fox, Kit Fox, small pulse, double heat sink, double heat sink kit, nice. 
So we made up actually pretty well on that for stuff we can use. All right, let's have a quick look here. So 9,000 repairs, which is really nothing. So we did make a little bit of money off this, but not much. Not that it makes that much difference. So let's get uh, let's get this Grinner back real quick here before we go today. And I want to have a look. We're having a lot of problems with heat on this guy. Um, so let's have a quick look and see what we can do. So we need two double heat sinks. So we can pull a double heat sink. What do we got here? 84, 89. Something's funky here for some reason. Let's take this out and let's grab the, where are you here? Exchanger and drop it in. Uh, what did that say? Do we already have an ex exchanger? Oh, it's in the center. Oh, we already do have one. Um, heat bank? Where are you? Where are you, heat bank? Let's go with that instead. I think in the, on the Grinner that'll help out more than anywhere else. The fact that it's sprinting all the time. Uh, yeah. I think we go that route. Actually, you know what? Since this is an inner sphere mech and not an Omni, should we go with an evasion? Because we're right up front with this mech all the time. Let's put the evasion gyro in there. That'll help out a little bit. And we only got basic sensors. I don't think we've got any other sensors stuff here. No, we don't. Hence the imaging. Gives us plus one accuracy, minus one recoil. Plus four initiative. Yeah, I think we have to leave that in there. All right, so let's go with this route. So that's definitely going to help out the Grinner. Uh, the Nova, I think, is fine. Cougar is fine. So, actually, let's. I think we've got. Yeah, we've got an exchanger in this guy already. Now we don't have one in this guy. See if we can do something about this here. So we could remove a double heat sink. Let's do that. Let's use the exchanger in here. Where are you? Yeah, let's go that route. This is going to help out on hotter planets. Um, Stormcrow Prime is operating really good. So let's have a look at this guy. I wonder if... Heat sink cooling pod, if it'll make a difference. So we're at 7280. And if we drop the heat sink cooling pod in... 6977. It's still the same. Still the same. Let's leave the cooling pot out. Yeah. Nothing else we can do here, eh? Got an exchanger in already. Yeah, I gotta leave it like this, I guess. Alright. No biggie. Actually, wait a second. Guardian ECM. If we're staying, this is one and a half tons, right? If we're staying at range, if we put the advanced, oh, it's four tons. I was going to say we could put the advanced AMS in and help everybody out, but four tons is a lot of weight to be carrying around. So let's leave it like this. Unless 
we trade out a large pulse for the ER medium pulse that's two tons plus four for the laser AMS we're saving a lot of heat too which means we could put another weapon on hmm no I think I'll leave it this way for now yeah okay we're going to end the episode here, guys. We'll get our mechs back and our pilots back. And when we come back next time, try and take another three skull mission um, just to see what we got going. And we've got plenty of uh, sea bills. So once we get the Argo upgrade done next uh, episode, we'll try and get another another thing going on the, on the Argo. Um, so we're making good progress now. Uh, we took us a little while to get rolling, but we're actually rolling pretty well now. So starting to hit a little bit above weight. Um, and we're just going to start targeting those those um, medium max, hopefully some heavy max to get some parts. And that's about it. All right. So if you like the episode, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free, feel free to subscribe and drop any comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.